talking about mindfulness, we're talking about meditation, you can do it any time. We need to actually learn to take time to nurture ourselves, just like we nurture everybody else. We forget about that. So we have to find calmness in our minds. So meditation actually can improve mood disorder, anxiety, depression, attention deficit disorder, post-traumatic stress disorder. Meditation can help to reprogram our synapses. So neuroplasticity or brain retraining. So this is a hot topic. We can actually reverse um, some of the, the bad synapses that we have in our brain. So they've looked at functional MRIs where they actually see the activity of what's going on in the brain. And they see that when we, um, when we do this meditation that we can actually change those synapses on the functional MRI, it's actually seen. Just like we can see that heart disease can be reversed in the cardiac CAT scans, we can see this on the, the functional MRIs. It helps with diabetes. Um, stress reduction is important in diabetes. Uh, I find that those people that are most relaxed, their sugars are under the best control. If they're sleeping well, if they're eating well, all of those things. Um, cancer oncology support. Um, insomnia, again, counting your breath is important. Um, irritable bowel, GERD, can actually be helped because a lot of that is associated with the gut-brain axis. So anxiety, depression can lead to issues with your stomach. Your stomach can cause issues with anxiety, so it's all connected. Hypertension can be improved with meditation. You can lower blood pressure um, and come off medications. Uh, heart disease, can, you can decrease uh, myocardial infarction as well as um, stroke. The NIH did a study of 600 people. They took um, these people and did yoga, tai chi, meditation, mindfulness, they found that it improved mental and physical outcomes in the patients. <clears throat> they reduced stress, it improved their sleep, and it prevented chronic illnesses like cancer, hypertension, heart disease, um, dementia, as well as rheumatoid arthritis. So knowing all this, we want to reduce our stress on a daily basis so that we could reduce the medical problems.